this ain't gonna cut it either. Let's give it one more. Let's see if we can get a better setup. If you're running around for 10 plus turns, you're in trouble. Not saying you can't. It's just gonna be rough. I keep getting so many, um, so many whales. Should have played. Should have tried this with the Spanish, I guess. Spanish are pretty good. I want to try it with the British, though. I think it'd be pretty, pretty cool thing to do with them. More whales. Ha! Huh, two whales. Oh no. There's the Arabs. Mm, that doesn't look good to me. Tomorrow? Uh, I'm not planning to. Uh, this could possibly work here. Way to go, dudes. You messed up. Hey, Zulu. What's going on? Not a perfect start here, but this could work.
Come on, guys. Act like you've been practicing. Gonna feel like Robin Hood by the end of this game. Shooting all these arrows. Three artifacts. Okay. I can live with that. All right, Squishy, I'll see you later, man. I'm just gonna, I'll re-upload on YouTube, so uh, you can catch it there, too. See how this turned out. See here. Five, six. Let's put some pressure on him. Thirty gold for monarchy. Question is, how much gold would I end up stealing? I don't really know. I could steal gold, but I don't know how much that would be. I threaten this guy. This is late in the game, so got to be careful.
Oh man, was it like that the whole time? Should have been like this. Oh hell. Just trying to screw myself over. Four, five, seven, eight. That could be good. Uh, let's see. Mm. Gonna go get that knight for sure. That's a dead end right there. <laughs> Zulu hopefully he just but leaves me alone I don't want anything to do with that guy oh oh we got some activity
It's not enough, man. 30 gold. All right. Looks like we're getting a settler here, so that's cool. Trying to figure out what kind of resources are available around here. Nice to get this back over by me, but that may not be an easy thing to pull off here. I think the Romans are right here too. Hooray! <sighs> Alphabet? Hooray! Horseback riding. I didn't need that at all. Man, no goodies here in this corner? Come on, man. Come on, man. Oh. They got die right next to their capital. That's a terrible idea. Gonna send this guy back. That way, it's easier to defend. Um, if I put the settler on the boat, I feel like it's going to take forever to do, to turn that into, uh, something useful. We got the Romans over here. Maybe we can sell them something. Yeah, you guys can have horseback riding for 15. Cool. What else you got?
There we go. Hey guys, what's going on? <laughs> That's not what I meant. <laughs> oh, come on, I was just kidding. Oh, come on, guys. Do we all have to be at war? Guy must have archers, I mean. I've seen weirder things though. Oh, no way. A sucker. Wow. Could it be? <laughs> Could have got feudalism there. There was a shot. <laughs> yeah, I think the Zulu are having a good game over there. They're doing pretty well. going to keep the Arabs busy. Let's see what they do. If I camp on their trees, see if they like that. All right, going to try to set this guy up over here on the coastline. Uh, this is going to have to be the spot, I suppose. Nothing amazing aside from that. Kind of lagging in tech. It's turn 36 and uh, Zimbabwe is kicking some butt over here. 
So how are we doing in the tech race right now? That's the question. Hey, can still get writing first, so that's not too bad. I like that my spies have their own fortress surrounding them. There's nothing I can really build at the moment, so... Maybe a barracks? Would that be really dumb? Yeah, I think so. I want a barracks, but I don't I don't think I need one. This guy's gonna level me up. Thanks, buddy. Getting a great person, so that's gonna help. Hopefully, it's something awesome. Oh, oh, it's a caravan. I could get feudalism right now, but that's not gonna help me. Not right now, anyway. Really what I need is code of laws, because I need to expand in this circumstance. I need to expand. Why? I need cities, man, because I just need a lot of technology if I can't even attack. So I'm going to need to be able to defend myself. I need to get democracy. Well, no, I don't. Well, I can't attack, so I might as well, right? Why not go, why not beeline for that? <laughs> At least this will skip me ahead five turns and get me code of laws, so that's not bad. Yeah, code of laws is just too important right now. Hoplite attack is the same as archers. It's only one. They're one three, so they're exactly the same as my longbow. Thanks, buddy. Tripoli, 60 gold. You got it. Dude, I have so many. So many spies.
All right, some Republic. Nope. No. Here they come. Damn, somebody got currency already? Who got currency? Ooh. Ugh. Are the Chinese really in this game? Damn it. The litter, someone's got literacy. That sucks. Hey, that's not what I did. Yeah, the Zulu kind of faked me out there. Did a little uh, run up the middle. Woo! 20 gold. So this is going to be 7.5 defense. I'm going to have to actually... I think I'll have to do something about that. Oh. Don't want to give me money. <laughs> you gave me iron working. Thanks, buddy. De using diplomacy can really work out. Obviously, I got out of a sort of a jam there. Got a technology. In exchange for 10 turns a piece, I mean, that's pretty awesome.
Romans aren't too worried about me. They are not worried at all. We do know we know the Zulu have some firepower now. So we're gonna have to watch out. And I'm at a critical expansion phase, so gonna have to do this the right way. This is a nice production city right here. Not quite as wealthy here, so I'm gonna have to be a little bit more conservative. I don't have a ton of resources due to my terrible start. Could sell some of these stupid spies that aren't doing anything. Just bleeding these guys. They're just letting me kill a guy here, a guy there. I mean, I know you're the computer, but you do have finite resources, even though you're a giant cheater. What are the Romans doing, man? Are they crazy? Can I get the wall? Can I get the wall? The wall would be good. Get construction. I need democracy. Yeah, I got a double whale city here. I guess I need settlers more than I need wonders at this point, so that's what this city should be doing. I think Zulu got bored of me. He is bored.
Oh, shoot. That's not good. Thought he had it. He did not have it. Should have known when it was looking bad. Should have canceled when it was down to three. It's too risky. Yeah, that, that archer choked, man. Need some gold. I'm actually going to sell these guys Code of Laws because I want him to get away from fundamentalism. I don't care about the technology so much. I just want them to go Republic. It's looking like democracy next. I need to, I need that edge right now. Am I still streaming? Sure, I hope so. Oh, you must have left and come back? Yeah, I did a I started up a second game here.
Oh, it's the Japanese, not the Chinese. I feel a little bit better about that because Japanese are... I don't know, they feel like they're a little less aggressive. <clears throat> Japanese is tied with me right now. Scooting around with some boats there. Uh, let's see. Honestly, I think Zulu and probably Arabs are probably the most aggressive. Uh, I've kind of squelched the Zulu, but it took a lot of work. I, I'm never happy if I'm next to the Zulu because the two the warrior movement is pretty rough. And then fundamentalism from the Arabs. So they're both pretty rough. Yeah, whales, baby. What's the precursor to miss to math? I'm gonna have to get that one turn, one turn tech. Just get that out of the way. This should be interesting. I don't know what's going to happen here at this. Here at Tripoli. Let's take a look at these cities real quick. Definitely made it a tougher game, no doubt. Oh man. This is not enough cities though. It's too... It's really not.
So this is archers running around. Assuming he's not about to go to war with me. What's this guy? What's this guy know? It's not gonna allow that, is it? Dude, that is a bug. Did you see that? So what is it gonna hold that until it reaches three population? That's strange. Whatever. That was interesting. The Arabs keep getting screwed over. The Romans really just got screwed up because uh, the Arabs expanded over there. You know what's funny about that? I think, did Republic pay off? Is that what happened? They gave him Republic. Gave them code of laws and they expanded, but I don't think it was because of Republic. Maybe they just that really helped me out though, because I did not want them coming over here. That could have been bad news. So that's a good break for me. Um, I would love to put a couple more, like a city here. At least make use of this die over here. I mean, this whale. <laughs> okay. I wonder if the Zulu are going to get froggy anytime soon. Wait, what do you want? I always want to trade stuff with them. Oh, they're building a legion unit. Ironically, the Arabs are turning out to be a pretty decent ally here. I don't know if they're just terrified of these spies I have camping around here.
Am I going to get navigation first? I think I am. That would be really good. Really, really good. Japan has some premium real estate over there. What? Nice. Oh, we got a boat. We got a boat, baby. Thank goodness. All right, we need all this stuff. We need this. Don't really like this tech tree right now, but not much I can do about it. Can't get anything cool here yet. Mm. Let's check our whale situation here. Oof. There we go. Where'd the archer army go? I want to take them down, but not even close to it. Those odds are not that good. Oh, Arabs ejected me.
I don't know how many cities I need, but I'm just going to keep building them as long as I can. Invention? Is that what's up next? Oh, I think so. And we'll get a great person. Hopefully it's something worthwhile. I've had these uh, spot... Ooh, whoa, what happened here, dude? One, two, three. Now, if I could get a great builder, that'd be perfect. That way I could build East India Company. I'm going to need some help on my tech here. I think Atlantis is going to be over here, so... My income's not so good, so maybe I'll just go try to find Atlantis. That tree is my MVP right there. There we go. Finally got this. Did that say someone switched switch to monarchy? Is that what that said? Ah, you punk. Nice. We got that. What else can we get? What can we get? Let's get steam. Oh, 
Oh no. Oh yeah, that could be a problem. Who knows, maybe he'll switch to Republic. They're both in Republic. <sighs> That's not good. Right now I'm kind of at a stalemate with uh, the Japanese who are all by themselves just doing whatever they want. Alright, I'll take a scientist. What the heck's going on here? This capital's going bananas right now. There we go. There's Atlantis. But I don't really want currency. If I research this for one turn and then get it, that might actually be better. Hmm, so here you get gunpowder. And then I could at least attack a little bit. That would be a big plus. And I could do it right now instead of waiting forever. I would say steam, steam actually, no, I think I'll save it for later. Nothing I can really do about that right now. My, ooh, not good.
should I stick with democracy? a tough decision. I think I'm going to have to keep going with my technology. Hey, they're going to let me have peace. That's good. It's because they res they see the power. They respect power. I haven't been able to steal great people or anything, man. Come on. What's wrong with you guys? It's a big capital, man. See, it was all that time I was making him grow his city, I was sitting on his trees and it made him, his city get too big. <sighs> all right, I'm gonna have to keep going here. And I gotta get steam. I don't know what he's doing, but I don't like it. One. Not yet, man, not yet. Damn guy took my city. That's not cool. What are you doing? Get on that. I always catch these cities slacking. Working the wrong tiles.
Can you believe it? I'm actually building libraries. Cruiser in Hastings, gonna need that right away. <sighs> Could get industrialization. That's a good one. Need it now. It's getting too dicey, too dicey. Pathetic, man, pathetic. So at least I'm getting a lot of gold per turn now. Uh, I'm gonna have to try to get didn't get a university university first, so it's gonna have to be railroad. Yep, good luck. Yep, good night. Snipes, deadly snipes. I think I got it. I think I can do this. All right, we got the double naval support, which is the key here.
Do I gotta build a temple or something, man? I don't wanna lose this city. I feel like I almost have to. Losing this would be pretty devastating. It's a nice city. Sure as hell is not building a wall. One ten gold to save that city? I mean, I think so. I think it's worth it. Save the city. So that's a good thing. That's unfortunate, but fortunate at the same time. Well, it's not a total waste because the temple will get a cathedral. So that's kind of cool. I was not anticipating another... Uh, <laughs> another one of those out there. Artifacts... Yes! <laughs> oh man, that was hilarious. That was awesome. Um, Might be able to take out Zimbabwe if I just build some. Need some riflemen. Wow, a cathedral. I haven't had one of those in a long time.
I don't think they're going to try that again. Actually, they will try it again. They don't care. You need to get gunpowder. actually use some of those pies over here I can find something for them to do Can't build it. Ooh. Pretty brutal. You guys don't have literacy yet? What is wrong with you? Nice. Archers are kicking butt. Lost the city. There we go. Dude, the Japanese have went totally insane. They have expanded everywhere. Kind of surprised they wanted peace. Oh, 
Uh, let's hit the 1,000 gold milestone, I suppose. Better than nothing. kind of rolling around with this galleon getting some intelligence Let's see what the heck these Japanese are up to they're going totally insane I need to knock these guys out of the game the Zulu they're just causing all kinds of problems for me oh, is it, oh, 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 oh. that's not good Mass production would be nice. I could at least get something I could attack with. I mean, riflemen are not bad though. So it's mass production or corporation. That's what I'm going for. How many turns? Both are going to take forever. But we got granaries. Yay! Drop the spies off in here. What? They rejected steam power? Okay. Well, it looks like I got these cruisers just in time. Because at long last, the Romans have broke through.
Well, they did something smart, so good for them. Gonna have to hold them off here. I need to buy some time. Looks like they're trying to squirt by. So, can't let that happen. They're in trouble now. They lost their defensive unit. You messed up, buddy. You messed up. We just have to amass units for now.
serious. Got some good science cities here on the north side. They're living in an aquarium? You hear water sounds. I don't know. I don't know what you mean. Are you maybe getting feedback from the game or something? If you're getting feedback from that, I should turn this down. Well, it looks like we held off the Romans pretty handily. No problem. So that's going to buy us plenty of time. Kind of surprised the riflemen advanced. Thought they'd be like the archers where they would just hang back. ABC. Alright, just making sure the chat was overlaying there. Only question now, should I get steel? I think I should get steel. Or mass production. I think steel is more important. Steel. Wish I could get metallurgy though. I want to get all those prereqs though. That's a lot of prereqs. Get East India Company though, so that's not too bad. Maybe I can get there a little faster.
think we think we got it now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Which wonder, which wonder? You hold off on that for now. Uh, once I get steel, I'm going to go on the offensive here. I'm still in democracy. We got democracy and monarchy in this game right now. I'm just going to hold off. Great. Magna Carta. Um, looking at three different wonders, looking at Samurai Castle, looking at uh, Leonardo's Workshop and the Military Industrial Complex. Um, gonna, every little edge I could get here would be really nice. So, you know, maybe the Military Industrial Complex will help even it out a bit here.
So I'm about to get the samurai castle anyway. So I think this will help. Not one that I normally build. But you know, now I got a battleship, so this is pretty awesome. Once I get mass production, I'm swapping. This should be interesting. I've never attacked like this. So really just one wonder left that I want to get. I want to get um, Leonardo's workshop so I can upgrade all these guys to modern infantry. So that's in a couple turns here. Man, this thing is awesome. Romans still angry. Here we go. Uh, got modern infantry, so don't really need anything else. That's pretty much the ultimate. Do I need any of these other things? Not really. This is going to be interesting. Too little, too late, Japan. Japan's impressive though, they're really coming along in technology. Monarchy, Republic, Fundamentalism, Republic. Monarchy? Is 
to be on. Sure, why not? Makes sense with the British, right? That's okay. That's okay. Uh oh, they want peace. The computer can crank out these riflemen faster than anything. Like they're free. Thank you.
Japanese got a bunch of airplanes flying around, but they're not really doing anything. So, not sure what they got on their mind. I think I can flip that city, so I'm not going to worry about that guy. Um, Got some gold. S. Hello, S. Monkey looking. Yeah, I upload everything to YouTube as well. Alright, we're heading straight for Japan. These guys are causing so many problems. Damn you! Oh well. Oh.
Goodbye, Zulu. Cruiser battles. Coming up on Kyoto here. Looks pretty, pretty juicy. Let me sure everyone's healed up here. What the hell? Airplane versus soldiers? This is getting wacky. These guys need veteran. Freaking battleships can't do everything. Wow. Tanks. Holy cow. Holy crap, this is epic. Damn roads. Funny thing about this is that I, when I'm injured, I barely lose any attack <laughs> because it's so much naval support. <sighs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> hilarious. You think this guy's pissed off? I think so. Just go for Rome, I think. I don't need all these other cities. I didn't know you can go boat to boat like that. Never tried that. What do we got left here? Really just two capitals. Alright, we got everyone in the car. I think so. Alright, let's go. <laughs> I'm flipping cities and everything. What the hell are the Romans doing? Oh, 
Uncivilized. Really? Gonna have to go around the west side here. be a jackass I would like to flip a few more cities here ah they built a wall that's hilarious what the hell are you doing here Oh boy. Here we come, baby. You're going down. It kind of boggles my mind. Using airplanes. Unless they just know something I don't hear. Infantry versus pikemen. I don't think I've ever seen that. No way, man. No peace. <laughs> I'm declaring war on everyone. Kind of want to take out this city too, just because I have a road connecting them. Wow, a submarine.
I don't have any elite units yet. You can get some pretty insane defensive numbers. I don't know if you've ever had like a armies attacking you over and over. You can get it up to like 230 or something crazy like that in terms of uh, defense. It's actually kind of fun to because you can get leadership, engineering, loyalty, and then you can get boats for defense and a wall. Oh. Woo. That was close. Flip <laughs> uh. one of their cities. That's cool. Game's got like 9 million notifications for me.
Come on, man. I just built stuff right there. It should reassign. I don't think I've ever seen that. Medic infantry? Medic's a good one because I got to deal. Might have to heal a little bit here. So it's really satisfying when you uh, when the computer starts getting a lot of momentum, and uh, you take like, for example, Japan's capital and one of their best cities, and then all of a sudden it's just like, whoa, what happened? It's kind of nice to get their seated their cities and see them, you know they. They did a really good job programming the AI in this game. Like, yeah, it's not perfect, but believe me, programming AI is not easy. There's so many things you have to think about in this game and consider. But it's part of what makes this game so great. Damn, these tanks are gangster. Oh! Yes! Dude, are you crazy? Came all this way to kill you? A little too close.
Yeah, man, this game's classic. This is like uh, one of the greatest single-player games, I think, of all time. Like, if you had to take a game to a desert island and it's just you, no internet, I would take... This would be one of the games I would take. I have clobbered the computer so many times in this game. It's so satisfying. That's all they got, man. I don't think they got any more armies. <laughs> it's a new era of peace after... Actually, they were pretty friendly with me the whole game. So it took, that took a long time. At least for me, 1915 is like one of my latest victories in all, since like I was learning the game. We did it. We did it. Definitely tough. Uh, managed to do it with one die, though. Not too bad. And, man, that took a long time. This Zulu is just, like, killing me. I wouldn't say it was a great start. But it was an okay start. I did have to restart a few times to get a decent, a decent setup. Because you don't want to just have a rotten start or it'll take you like forever to win or you're just not going to win at all but that was an interesting challenge um give it a try let me know if you have success trying this out how hard it how much difficulty you have with it um i had i had fun with it it was uh definitely a tough challenge i think it's an interesting one um so no warriors just arch any you can only build units I have, uh, you can build settlers and uh, archers, anything that has defense higher than offense or attack. So you can build pikemen, archers, riflemen, modern infantry. Uh, you can get knights and all the free units from uh, artifacts and all that. That's fine. But uh, it's an interesting challenge. I enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed it too. Um, this will be re-uploaded to YouTube. So uh, definitely check it out there too and subscribe and follow if you enjoyed the stream here on Twitch. Uh, I try to t stream on uh, my schedule it for uh, Thursdays and Mondays um, at 9 Eastern, so whatever that is for you, that's 1 a.m. GMT time, and that's what five, five Western time zone, Pacific time. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm gonna end the video here.